The screen is showing odd color patterns. System seems to have locked up. <laughs> I think we'll uh, glitch the system. Locked up. Oops. Monitor flickers. It seems as though the system is in a reboot status. Well, maybe that's a good thing. But it doesn't look like it's going to reset this... These lights now, you can see with that... Alarm going off. Computer. Unable to get any useful info. Oh, you managed to get an interface screen out of the VATS control computer. Here we go. Okay. Asking for a command. All right, three six two. Sixty seconds. I don't know what we just did. I don't know if something's going to happen out here, or uh, guards are going to come. Thirty two seconds. going to check these other machines until uh, that one executes whatever it is we <laughs> told it to do. This is still locked up. That one's still rebooting. Rebooting. Monitor's flickering on this one. We were like 0 oh, for 2, I think. That was the wrong command to issue. I guess it was like a self-destruct sequence. But at least that time, nobody won. <laughs> Alright. I think we had the right idea. Man. I think we'll go back and... Look at that computer again. <laughs> Sneaking by these guards. Lab technicians surrender. This one seems to be the only one that, uh, Allowed us to use it. Alright, 
you managed to get an interface screen out of the VATS control computer. <clears throat> I think this time we'll try to get information first. We don't want to set base to alert status. Alright, the options are Gray, Bayarski, Maxson, and Anderson. Trying for Gray. Download log of Richard Gray. Okay. Boyarski. Unexpected end of line. Bad data encountered. Maxon. Alright, I think we got that. Anderson. Again, bad data encountered. Let's just look at that then. All right, Richard Gray audio diary. All right, quite quite a bit. Try to quickly uh, scan this in case there's anything pertinent for right now. All right, I'm dying. I need to get this down before the pain overwhelms me. He doesn't know what happened to Harold, but it sounds like he fell into a vat. Possibly by mistake. Francine is dead, killed by one of the robots. He was able to hack the computer to turn off the robots. That's exactly what... <laughs> What he's trying to do? Talking about uh, the changes to his... ...molecular structure, I guess. He's feeling stronger. A tendril sprung from his stomach. <laughs> Sounds like one of those, uh, I think, floater things that we saw out in the wasteland. He's wondering if he's uh, hallucinating all this. All right, his mental facilities are improving. Now he's wondering what would happen if he put animals in the vats. He dipped a dog and a rat at the same time, fused together. And it's more than one. All right. I have become the instrument through which unity will be achieved. I am so much more than a human being now. Wondering then if uh, this gray is perhaps the master who we're actually looking for. Maybe this is an account of the first super mutant. It is time to bring others into the glory that is the unity. Certainly sounds like it. He encounters a lost soul. Talking about the FEV virus. He has a neural link with the base computer. Strange. All right. A neural link with the base computer. <clears throat> 